Hi students, welcome all. We are discussing chapter 11, conic sections. In our previous modules, we discussed about circles and parabolas. Now in this module, we are going to discuss about ellipse. An ellipse is the set of all points in a plane, the sum of whose distances from two fixed points in the plane is a constant. The two fixed points are called foci. This is a plural of focus. So there are two fixed points. Distances between two fixed points is sum of distance. That is, if there is a point, if it is F1, F2, F1, F2, let it be P1. That is P1 F1 plus P2 F2 is the same constant P K. Some set of points which are satisfies this condition this P2 F1 plus P2 F2. P2 F1 plus P2 F1 plus P2 F2 is the same constant. The set of points which satisfies this condition forms an ellipse. There is another point P3. P3 F1 plus P3 F2 is equal to the same constant, etc. This set of points forms an ellipse. The line passing through the focus is known as the axis. Yeah, there, there will be two axes, one is major axis and another will be minor axis. Okay. There are two types of ellipses. It is x axis, y axis. And the focal lies on x axis. This is the first type. This x axis, y axis, first type, type 1. Here the focus lies on x axis. It will be c 0 and minus c 0. The vertex will be 0 0. Equation of this type of ellipse is x square by a square plus y square by b square equal to 1. Here the denominator of x square will be greater than the denominator of y square. In this case the denominator of x square will be greater than denominator of y square and the relation connecting a square b square and this c a and b here this vertex is a0 this minus a0 here it will be 0b and 0 minus b the relation connecting a b and c is given by c square equals a square minus b square in the first type ellipse, denominator of x square will be greater than denominator of y square and the relation connecting a, b and c is given by c square is equal to a square minus b square. Next, we define center, vertices, foci, etc. Okay, vertex, uh, center, center is given by center of ellipse is always 0, 0 and the focus, foci is given by plus or minus c0 vertices plus or minus a0 the equation of major axis is in this case equation of equation of major axis is x axis. This x axis is the equation of 
major axis. Equation of x axis is y is equal to 0. Then the equation of minor axis will be that is y axis its equation is x is equal to 0. Then the length of major axis, the length means distance from two vertices. The length of major axis distance from two vertices. The distance from two vertices. That is from minus a 0 to a 0. Length of major axis is equal to 2a. And the length of minor axis will be 2b length of minor axis will be 2b. Here the eccentricity is given by E is equal to C by A. The length of lattice rectum or the length of lattice rectum. Length of lattice rectum of parabola is 4a. Here we have length of lattice rectum as 2b square divided by a. This is the first type of ellipse. Now let us discuss next type. Okay. Type 2. Second type ellipse is here the major axis will be y axis. X axis, y axis, and the ellipse will be of the form. This equation is x square by b square plus y square by a square equals 1 and here the denominator of y square will be greater than denominator of x square denominator of x square is here it is b minus b and this will be a minus a and focus lies on y axis c n minus c. Now let us de define its center, vertices and focus etc. Center is 0, 0. Here also a relation connect connecting c a b with c square equals a square minus b square. Now center and focus 0 plus or minus c here the vertices vertices and focus lies on the axis here axis of the parabola is y axis then the vertices is 0 plus or minus a now equation of <coughs> equation of major axis the equation of major axis is y axis that is x is equal to 0 equation of minor axis it is x axis its equation is y equal to 0 then the length of major axis length means distance from minus a to a it will be 2a total distance will be 2a that is the length of major axis C equal to 2a, the length of minor axis is equal to 2b, eccentricity e equal to c by a, and finally the length of lattice rectum is equal to 2b square by a. If we are given an ellipse, we have to compare with one of these two types. And we can find the center vertex um, focus, equation of major axis, minor axis, its length and length of lattice rectum, eccentricity, etc. Okay. We will discuss some problems in our next module. Okay, students, thank you.